Matthew chapter 2 <coughs> Now, when Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, in the days of King Herod, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he who is born King of Jews? For we saw his star in the east, and have come to worship him. When King Herod heard it, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him, gathering together all the chief priests. And let's look. Where is Judea? Judea should be north of Jerusalem, about here. So, if、uh, if they want go to Egypt, they go this way. Okay, all Jerusalem with him, gathering together all the chief priests and the scribes of the people. He asked them where the Christ would be born. They said to him, "In Bethlehem of Judea." For this is written through the prophet, "Your Bethlehem, land of Judah, are in no way least among the princes of Judah. For out of you shall come forth a governor, who shall shepherd my people Israel." Then Herod, secretly called the wise man. Learned from them exactly what time the star appeared. He sent them to Bethlehem and said, "Go and search diligently for the young child. When you have found him, bring me word, so that I also may come and worship him." They, having heard the king, went their way, and behold, the star which they saw in the east. Went before them until it came and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceedingly great joy. They came into the house and saw the young child with Mary his mother, and they fell down and worshipped him. Opening their treasures, they offered to him gifts. Gold, frankincense, and、uh, myrrh. Being warned in a dream that they shouldn't return to Herod, they went back to their own country another way. Herod, king of Herod, it should be an ancient, ancient、uh, nation to the east of the Dead Sea and.、Uh, Jordan River Valley of Jordan River. This is Jerusalem. Judea is to the south of Jerusalem. We continue now. When they had、uh, departed, the wise man, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, saying, "Arise and take the young child and his mother." And flee into Egypt and stay there until I tell you. For Herod will seek the young child to destroy him. Joseph is Jesus' father. If they burn this area, they won't flee to Egypt. Here is the Egypt, the river of Nile. Here is the Red Sea. The east coast of the Mediterranean Sea, and they they are going to went through there. Let's measure the distance from south of Jerusalem to Cairo is 400 kilometers direct、uh, distance. Okay, let's continue. Joseph had been told by, had learned the information from Angel. He arose and took the young child and his mother by night, 
and departed into Egypt, and was there until the death of Herod, that it might be fulfilled which was spoken by the Lord through the prophet, saying, Out of Egypt I called my son. Then Herod, when he saw that he was mocked by the wise man, was exceedingly angry, and sent out, and killed all the male children who were in Bethlehem and in all the surrounding countryside from two years old and under, according to the exact time which he had learned from the wise man. Then that which was spoken by Jeremiah the prophet was fulfilled, saying, A voice was heard in Ramah, lamentation, weeping, and great mourning. Rachel weeping for her children. She wouldn't be comforted because they are no more. But when Herod was dead, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared in a dream to Joseph in Egypt, saying, Arise, and take the young child and his mother, and go into the land of Israel, for those who sought the young child life are dead. Herod. We know Herod uh, should be a nation to the east of the Valley of Jordan. And uh, let's check for some history information of Herod. Because the Gospel from Matthew isn't a record of history, it cannot be viewed as history record. But the story, it's a lot of story, and we learn that uh, at least uh, those stories tell what people think, what people feel in the ancient time. Okay, Herod. Herod was raised as Jew, a lawyer supporter for High Hyrcanus the Second. Actually, Heather, ha- Herod is a king in ancient time. Judea. Okay, let's continue. Herod was dead. Joseph heard the message. He arose and took the young child and his mother and came into the land of Israel. But when the land of Israel commonly referred to the Levant, Levant area. This is Levant area. This area is very important in ancient time in the evolution of our civilization. Here, the river of Nile. Here, the river of Euphrates. Euphrate, maybe. Degrees. And uh, this is area of Levant, and uh, the story happened here, around from area around the Dead Sea to Sea of Galilee. Here is the city of Jerusalem. If they talk about the holy city, we most time they talk about Jerusalem. Okay. Joseph arose and took the young child and his mother, and came into the land of Israel. But when he heard that Achilles was reigning over Judea in the place of his father, Herod, he was afraid to go there. Being warned in a dream, he withdrew into the region of Galilee, and came and lived in a city called Nazareth, that it might be fulfilled which was spoken through the prophets. He will be called another ring. This is chapter 2 from Matthew, and uh, we see, we read chapter 2 of Matthew Bible, and we see it in the map, Google Earth the satellite map. This is uh, Jerusalem, and uh, here it's Egypt. Then, when he returned to land of Israel, he 
go to Nazareth. Nazareth is somewhere close to Sea of Galilee and to the east of the Galilee. Maybe here. And Herod Kingdom is here. Okay, so Jesus has been called a Nazarene because when he returned to Levante area, he lived and he came to Nazareth here. And uh, so he been called Nazarene. Okay. Nazareth should uh, be a area with uh, a lot of uh, hills and uh, mountains. Okay, this is Matthew chapter 2. Thank you.